How to install official MIUI Global Stable ROM from Magic X 3.7 ROM on Redmi Note 5 Pro. Hello and welcome guys. Welcome to Cracksuite YouTube channel and today in this video I'm gonna show you how can you install official MIUI Global Stable ROM if you are in Magic 3.7 ROM right now. So without wasting time, let's get started. As you can see here, this is Redmi Note 5 Pro and I'm on Magic X 3.7 ROM right now. And I'm going to install official MIUI Global Stable ROM from this Magic 3.7 ROM. So for this you need to download these two files from the description below and the first file is Peach Black Custom Recovery and the second file is MIUI Global Stable ROM zip file. And guys if you want to install this Magic ROM 3.7 without any error on your mobile then I have made a separate video on it. You can check the video will be in the description so that you can easily install Magic 3.7 ROM on your Redmi Note 5 Pro. So now we are going to install Global Stable ROM. So for this you have to power off your phone first of all and then go to the custom recovery mode as you know that to go to the custom recovery mode you have to press power button and volume up button simultaneously and then you will be redirected to the custom recovery mode and you can see here i'm in custom recovery twrp right now and you can see here it needs a password to decrypt the data and we don't know the password so that we can't go to the internal storage and we can't install any rom from this twrp and you can see here the internal storage is 0 MB. So for this you have to install custom recovery Peach Black from the computer. So now let's go to the computer. And one more thing guys, before going to the computer, you need to reboot your phone to the fast boot mode. So simply click on the reboot button and then click on bootloader. Then your phone will reboot to fast boot mode. But there is one issue with this Magic ROM right now and that is when you go to the fastboot mode you won't see any fastboot logo you just see a blank screen there but the phone is in fastboot mode only the logo disappears and the fastboot mode works perfectly fine so now connect your phone to the computer on fastboot mode and then let's go to the computer so we are in computer right now and you have to download this adb setup on your computer and copy this pitch black recovery that you download from the description below earlier. So at first install this adb setup on your computer and a command promote dialog box will appear. So click Y and hit enter button. Click Y and hit enter button again. Click Y and hit enter button again. And then click on next and then click on finish. And adb setup is properly installed on our computer. And now right click on Peach Black Recovery zip file and click on Extract Files. And click on OK button and Peach Black Recovery zip file is extracted here in this folder. So simply open this folder and then open TWRP folder and copy this recovery file. And then go to your C drive and go to your ADB folder. and paste the recovery file here and now click on the little box right over there as you can see here on the screen and type cmd and hit enter button and command promote will appear here so we have to type some commands here and our first command is fastboot space devices and hit enter button and some number will shown here that means our phone is connected in fastboot mode with the computer and type second command and that is fastboot space boot space and then drag the recovery file from adb folder to the command promote and then hit enter button and it will load here and at the very moment you will notice that your phone will also reboot here and then your phone will reboot to custom recovery peach black mode and now our work in computer is done. Now let's go to the mobile phone. And we are in mobile phone right now. So now you can remove the data cable. And you can see here we are in peach black recovery right now. So simply click on the install button first of all. And then select the peach black recovery zip file that you have downloaded from the description below. So simply click on it and then swipe. 
and it will extract here and then your phone will reboot to custom recovery mode and in some cases your phone will not boot to custom recovery mode just like mine my phone is not rebooting to the custom recovery mode so i have to manually reboot it to the custom recovery mode so for this i have to press power button and volume up button simultaneously and then your phone will reboot to custom recovery mode once again and remember if your phone automatically reboots to custom recovery then it's okay and if does not reboot to custom recovery mode then you only have to manually reboot it to the custom recovery mode and we are in custom recovery piece black once again so now click on the wipe button first of all so just click on the wipe button and click on advanced wipe button and from here you have to select dalvik system catch data and finder and then swipe and then go back and click on install button and here search for the miui global stable rom zip file that you have downloaded from the description below and click on it and then swipe and the installing process has been completed now click on the reboot system and click on do not install and then your phone will reboot to system here and this process might take some little bit of time so we have to wait here and you can see here finally the booting process has been completed now you have to do simple basic boot setup so i will skip this setup and directly go to the system so finally we have installed miui global stable rom on our redmi note 5 pro from magic 3.7 rom okay i will decrease the brightness here and you can see here the device name xiaomi redmi note 5 pro and you can see here the miui version MIUI 10 Global Stable 10.2.2.0 And I hope you understand how to install MIUI Global Stable ROM from Magic 3.7 And that's it for today guys, hope you like this video and if you like this video just let me know guys Hit that like button, comment below if you have any kinds of queries, suggestions or any kinds of problem And don't forget to share this video and don't forget to subscribe to our Cracksway YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so thank you for watching and see you in my next video until then goodbye.